Okay, okay so um, real quick, the variations of the Kimura. Okay. So on the Kimura, so again, if you already know it. So again, if he's grabbing, I can subo right in there, and that usually allows me to pop that off. If I can't do it, I put my elbow on the wrist and push it off with my hand. Okay. Like that. I want the guy's elbow at a 90 degree angle here. I'm going to pull him, dump my elbow to the mat, so now my weight is on the belly and my elbow is stopping him because now he can't branch, he can't sit up. And my wrist is going to go wrap his back. One. The other one is I over rotate and I go at a different angle. Obviously, this is a wrist walker. <laughs> the next one is if he straighten it out, I'm just going to keep on moving it to get it. The next one is if if I'm trying to get it and he's blocking my he's blocking my hip, I can't bring the hand to his back, so I'm going to bring his back to his hand by just walking around and getting the, the core up. The other one is I'm going to rotate and put the back of his fist in his armpit. In his armpit and then just rotate the elbow up or the shoulder up. A lot of times we're taught to put the foot all over the head so they don't sit up. But the way I was taught was putting my knee on top of the head. And the reason is because I'm, I'm attacking the shoulder joint right there. What I want to do is separate the shoulder from the head, elongate that muscle, and it pulls the socket out a little bit before I torque it. So as I'm doing this, my this goes on top. And I pull and pull. And I don't have to torque this. This Sense Make sense? Okay. So, those are the Kimura variations. So once I have the Kimura, one, two, this comes down. Grab the elbow, relax. This goes in here for the wrist bar. Then that goes down for the straight arm bar. Again, I'm not going to here. I'm going here. But my thumb has got to be underneath the elbow. So I can block it. Then I've got to control the wrist. I need that wrist on the mat. I pull it here, and that goes to this elbow, goes to the hip, and the most part, not going to be that flexible. When I'm doing the Americana, if I'm close to the, the chest, you're going to bridge. So I don't want that to happen. So I've got to shift my weight to the hip, and then do it. If I want to be nasty, I'm actually going to torque this, and then do it. Which gives me this next one. I pull the wrist into here, and I have sumo one, sumo two, sumo three. I set out, and I have that lock there. Sweet out. Squeeze lock. And then I go to case of Tommy. This is hand on here. My weight is over the floating rim, and I'm floating off my butt. And in order to attack this arm, I have to do a couple things here. I can push my weight for the sumo, I don't have the dexterity for it. So what I do is, my knuckle goes into his cheek, and I just sit down on it, and it freaking hurts. I can always get this one, relax, and this one here, and just stretch it out. Get that, or I can punch, he's gonna block. Nice. Here. This is like an ice cream cone. Not this way, ice cream cone. That goes there. Stump is up. My, my thigh has to be right below that elbow because I have fulcrum, load, and weight, whatever it is. One, two, goes there. If he turns the thumb the other direction, I don't have an angle, see? So I have to bring the knee up. And then I can lock it this way, pinch my knees. If you, yep, I go the other direction, this goes in there. So this is where it needs to be subtle. There's three things here I'm going to do very subtly. First one is, let's lock. 
second one is going to be here. I push his head this way as this foot goes through that hole. Here's the subtle part. So subtle. Okay, now I'm going to take this out. And as I take this out, I have the wrist bump right there. I can slowly push it out from the head. And the wrist lock down. I transfer the wrist. This lock there. Transfer it back. Over here. I, this hand goes to the shoulder. This hand goes to the wrist. I separate it. Just like I'm separating a wing chicken from the bone. Then I push it over. Pull you on top of this leg. So I want knee, head, elbow, elbow. Thank you. 